Hello everyone and welcome back to Stellaris and our adventures with the Kazam or Kazam I, I don't know how they pronounce it actually but I guess I could make that up anyway uh, but Kazakar our home is doing well I guess I'll, honestly it's been very calm uh, the first two episodes and that's usually how it goes but I know it can escalate quickly so I better not be lulled into a false sense of security or anything. Uh, there are signs of activity by an ancient precursor. Oh, that's that's the ancient precursor civilization on this inhospitable rock. Is that? I mean, I'm always trying to figure out what the ancient relic pack story pack actually does versus other ancient anomalies. But maybe it's all the things. I don't know. Research always research things. Uh, for those who might have missed the earlier episodes, uh, our species is an, a researching exploration species, uh, sort of like the Federation in Star Trek or how I imagined the Kerbals to be if they were going to expand beyond their solar system, or star system I should say. Anyway, uh, Voltam Observatory. An ancient Voltam Observatory has been found on the surface of YIA. I mean, what not IA, 1A. Uh, the YA, what? Way, 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 I'm gonna call it way. Way system is fairly distant from the region of space where the Voltam originated, and this facility appears to have been primarily used for the observation of their own stars. We have gone over the observatory's surviving data, but there are no clues as to exactly what the Voltam were searching for in their observations. Okay, maybe the Voltam are the uh, sort of an ancient relics kind of bunch. Anyway, so we've got one other world, uh, Dorelion. You can uh, see from the side here, the frontier sector there. Um, yep, we are getting ready to construct a new colony ship. We need to send it to Dradim after we get this uh, finished with building the star base there. We have one very small fleet right now, and I've tasked it to hold a Julau because we encountered alien vessels. I don't think that force is good enough to fight alien vessels with 775 power. I, I don't know. Uh, force? I don't know what units those are in. Military power, whatever points. Uh, as an arrow, fleet can be upgraded. Let me just um, see how it might be upgraded. How could we upgrade? Upgrade fleet. Uh, 57... System survey complete. Sure. I think it might be the armor, but I'm not sure. Okay, hole in the ground. Orbital telemetry shows a massive impact crater on the surface of Walzirin 3. It was not caused by a meteor strike, as the crater is surprisingly deep in proportion to its diameter. In fact, the actual depth could not yet be determined, as the shaft is choked by rock debris part of the way down, blocking any further orbital scans. How do you know it's an impact crater and not like a dug hole or drilled thing? Anyway, it appears that a conventional excavation is the only way to find out what lies below. Well, I guess they're excavating. Excavation file unlocked. Well, no, file locked. Well, I can't... Construction uh, complete. Construction are they completed. gonna do the thing, or...? I don't know how to deal with these archaeological sites, or what we're... View site. Yeah, I mean... Maybe I have to hire an archaeologist? I haven't seen one. Okay, system surveyed. Construction complete. And more construction complete. Let's see our science ship. What kind of that's ice asteroid, barren world, barren world. Well, might as well go down here. Um, this construction ship. Uh... Yeah, build that mining station. Have we not built all the mining stations we can here? I guess not. That's unusual. Our home system, we haven't finished building mining stations. 
An ancient space station of some kind has been located at the edge of, of the Lothandra system. The strong residual subspace signature that surrounds the station indicates that it may be a gateway of sorts. Uh oh. Part of a theoretical network of similar stations that at some point would have allowed for near instantaneous travel between different parts of the galaxy. Assuming this is a gateway, the current, its current state of this repair has rendered it unusable. Well, that's good, actually. Uh, if it could, could be restored into working order, its owner would potentially be able to access any other functional gateways in the galaxy, or other people could come through the other way, you know, enabling travel across huge distances in a matter of days. Intriguing. Well, that, that could start something. I noticed that our energy credit is, like, not increasing. Um, construction ship. Could you, like... Well, I guess we must be mining there. Um, we need to mine more places. There's more energy credits here, apparently. Come back here and build more mining stations, please. Okay. I thought we had a... Oh! Another cultist fe fleet loyal to the Fist of God has been sighted in the Boaway system. This time, however, their numbers include a strange ship of unfamiliar design. They've allied with aliens? Okay, battle station. Where the heck is the Boaway system? Uh, that's a huge thing. Okay, we need to... Okay, so we've got a science ship. A, sh a science ship. Oh, that's inconvenient to be there. Alright, let's build some more things. Mm, I want... Corvette, Corvette. Corvette. I need to design better ships. Is there a way... There used to be a way of doing that. What is the ship thing? Not down there. There are these icons over here. Uh, ship designer. Corvette defense platform, that's all we've got. God, the fusion reactor. Oh, that was the upgrade, the fusion reactor. Okay, well, we'll keep it as is. I don't think we have, we've had enough uh, upgrades to do anything with that. Okay, continue, please. Hopefully our shipyard can knock those out real quick. A faction, a new faction has recently been gaining traction in, faction has been gaining traction in the internal political landscape of the Kazam RUD. Led by scientist Cory, daughter of Utin, they call themselves the Democratic Watch. That's ominous. Uh, th their members work for equality and justice for all denizens of our empire could be dangerous. Anyway, a, a disgruntled faction will be a source of trouble. One that approves of the government's actions could be useful. Okay. Why do I have to press... Oh, another faction. Oh, now we've got two different... Institute of United Scientists. That's, that's more like our normal faction. That's what I was aiming for. Their members have been pushing hard for advancement of sciences. Hey, we're doing good. Uh, disgruntled faction. I, I don't think it should be disgruntled. Hmm, we've been doing excellent on that. No reason to be disgruntled. Okay, we'll eventually... Well, hopefully that's gonna do something useful. Where is... Oh, there's, that's our ships there. Oh, we're upgrading. It came back to upgrade the ships, but they have not been upgraded. It's going to take some time. Well, now our uh, credits are a little bit better. Okay, well, these get, this does not need to just sit there. We don't have enough to build another space station, so we better just develop what we've got. So, we could do with a uh, science station here. 
Actually, we could do with a science station here. Just go ahead and build a research station at home. Maybe I can increase speed now. Okay, remnants of a small Voltam Helium-3 mining base. <clears throat> the infamous Helium-3. But of course, now we have fusion reactors, so it makes sense. Have been found at the bottom of a large crater on Vixim Va. The blast that created the crater seems to have originated from inside the facility itself. Unstable fusion rate. Unless Voltam mining techniques were radically different from our own, uh, an equipment failure or accident cannot account for a massive. Oh, sabotage. Fascinating. Potentially sabotage, anyway. Three hundred and twenty-seven on the Cultus Marauders. Anomaly found. Oop, anomaly in Rixim Five. An ancient orbital shipyard drifts in silence above this world. It has suffered significant battle damage, and entire sections of the facility are missing. Research. Yep. And traditions. Well, I think we need to open a new line of traditions. I mean, we've got science division to boldly go. We don't have enough for polytechnic education, apparently. Um, I don't know why we don't have enough for polytechnic. And we've already... Oh, we haven't adopted that? Upgraded. Oh, okay. That's why. Okay, the first uh, fleet has been upgraded. Maybe I should go with uh, something else. Harmony. Expansion. Colony development speed. The colony uh, on Dorelium Prime uh, seemed to be really slow to develop. Um, diplomacy would be good, but that's not really our forte, maybe. Harmony. I mean, the adoption effect is only few... Food consumption is reduced by 10%. We've got some food. Colony development speed might be more interesting. Is there anything that would give us more influence? Because, yeah, that one. Uh, in addition, we'll unlock... Well, that's the finisher effect. Clear blocker cost reduced by 33%. Hmm... And I don't like the whole domination thing, that sounds... That sounds hostile. Starbase capacity. Um... But, uh, science division. I mean, we ha really don't need more research alternatives or scientist level cap yet. We're a long way off from needing that. Uh, oh, now we can actually see what's there. That's helpful. Unemployed. Oh, uh, hold on, hold on. No, no, that's the music that I don't care about. Okay, hold on. Um, leader lifespan increased. Well, that'll undo our... Uh, one of the traits that we had that was less fortunate. Um... Well, that faith in science is pretty good. Okay, uh, but I'm gonna go for... Let me see what the this expansion here is. Starbase influence cost reduced by 10%. Hmm, that, that could work better. That's really what I need the influence for. Colonization fever. New colonies start with one additional population. That could be nice. Boy, the population management has been completely different. I mean, I used to have to deal with that a lot more. Administrative capacity increased by 10, I mean 20, that hasn't even come up yet. Hmm. Let's begin with harmony and then go with expansion. No, let's go with expansion and go then do harmony, yeah. Okay, yes. Okay. 
So we've got that. We could get the next the next thing. Reach for a star. Reach for a star sounds good anyway, right? And then uh, colonization fever. Those are good. All right. While conducting this, oh, let me do this one first. Anomaly, a cursory scan of the planet's surface reveals a weak signal pulsing into the darkness of space. Research. Uh, while conducting the survey of Rixim 5, the SOS Ka Saranis uh, detected the remains of an automated shipyard in orbit. It is at least a thousand years old and seemed to have subject been subjected to a heavy missile barrage, but one of its manufacturing bays is still in working condition. Scientist officer Cory, daughter of Utin, is confident that power can be restored to the shipyard, that it would be a significant project. Interesting. Well, can we start that project? I mean... Okay, so let's see. Are we ready? We're not quite ready to deal with the cultist marauders yet. The shipyard needs to build some more. System survey complete. Okay, uh, there is a pattern of unusual sonic activity on Rixum 3. Excellent. I love... Well, it had a little cost there. It had something in red there. I should have probably paid more attention. Okay, system surveyed, system surveyed, anomaly. Construction complete, construction complete, anomaly. We need engineering research afterburners. Um, geothermal fracking. Well, more. Well, we don't. We're not short on minerals right now. Engineering, engineering research from nano mechanics. I don't even know where we get nano mechanics from, though. Construction complete. Uh, we like research. This is, but then afterburners might be good too. But let, let's go for research. Okay, that uh, looks a little bit more like our fleet can handle those guys. Let's send them. May Gori, daughter of Tag, lead her fleet well. So, where are our construction ships? Um, Why is that a special project? Oh, repair automated shipyard. Uh oh. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's let's focus on the combat here. Look at all the swirlies. <laughs> so this is what uh, combat in the future will look like. Who knew? It looks like orbits, lots and lots of orbits. It looks like universe sandbox too. Is what it looks like. Toy factory in the middle of battle. You're not, that's a battleship that we're fighting there, huh? There are. How do they get a battleship? Temple of Light, Righteous class. Seriously, there are structures on Rixim Three, uh, though most are less than ruins and more akin to rubble. The SOS Casaranis's initial pass over the planet reveals only one building that can be considered intact. Seemingly spared whatever calamity robbed Rixim 3 of its buildings and builders alike. That is the source of the noise. Not only is the building intact, reports science officer Cory, daughter of Utin, but it is active. It is a production facility of some sort, turning plasticine polymers into mute objects of uncertain but possibly ornamental purpose. Ornamental. The raw materials and end product are largely uninteresting to the Kazam RUD, but we could doubtlessly stand to learn something from the automated manufacturer's mag manufacturing process itself. Hmm, sure, why not? Gotta love toy factories. Can we commandeer that uh, battleship? Cultist fleet operating in the Bo uh, Boe system has been destroyed in battle. Boe away. Okay, um, okay, reduce speed. I think uh, things are going too fast here. That's a barren world gas giant. Anyway, there's not a whole lot to do in the Bowway system except for kill things. Oh, wow, it took that long to actually establish the colony. All right, well, this, this is a, a reassembled ship shelter. Housing three, amenities three, colonist jobs two. Well, possibly 11 districts. What's this? At 5 population, we get that unlocked. Oh, so actually increasing population is really important. 
Create a new sector. Well, I think I should create a new sector. Yeah, the Dorelion Prime Sector. Is that a good thing to do? Not very dangerous to delete a sector and a new one can just as easily be created. Well, okay, good. Manually developed automation on... Whatever, we'll just leave it be for now. Oh, I could make uh, create a governor. That's a different governor. Let's get a new governor. Yeah, we have enough energy credits. Uh, this is a young governor. Gains a lot of experience. They all... Food from people jobs. Ooh. Improves agrarian yield. I mean... I'm not pressed for food right now. Yeah, let's just recruit this uh, young governor. Hopefully the young governor got sent to the colony. Yeah, okay, good. Uh, the signal originates from the remains of an antenna-like structure. Exploratory probes were dispatched from the SOS Casaranus to the surface to investigate the matter more closely. What science officer Pock nearly Spock, a daughter of Bora found was a cavernous vault that, while easily pried open, was evidently the last safe house and refuge of some long-dead race of aliens. While reasonably technolo technologically advanced, it seems they nevertheless reached for the stars and perished on some planet-wide natural disaster. Oh, they never reached for the stars, sorry, not nevertheless. Never reached for the stars, shame. That's a lesson to all of us, we should always reach for the stars. The vault is immense, housing thousands upon thousands of black boxes, and the SOS Casaranas has determined uh, to be data storage devices. A special project has been prepared to decode their contents. So, like, special projects. I think there must be something where we do stuff with special projects as a market? Via the market screen, we can buy and sell oh! Boxes. But there's a market fee, so we don't really want to do that. But that's a good thing to do. All right. In case we need to. Policies, edicts, I haven't bothered with. Hmm. Okay, there was that thing we wanted to... Uh, this, we wanted to repair this automated shipyard and mining base. Okay, so construction ship... Okay, we can unpause now. Now let's get both construction ships over there. I want that one to... Might as well build the star base there, too. And... Well, we previously... Met some hostels over there. Um, maybe they're gone. I don't know. Oh, I guess it's a no-go. For my science ship. Shoot. Oh, these guys got at, at the... Okay, we've claimed this. But still, we should do something with it now. We've got like a whole bunch of potentially habitable worlds and all that. Um, can we build... A colony ship now. Yes, we can. Good. Let's do that. Well, uh, if we could bump back up to Hazra, let's get a. Uh, yeah, let's actually get one of the con. Uh, sorry, construction ships to Hazra to expand down here. instead. Alright, increase speed. Okay, one construction ship is at Rixim. And looks like 
yeah, doing the repairing the automated shipyard. That may be dangerous, maybe okay, who knows. Only one population here. Um, how do I find where, how well the population is increasing, I wonder. Well, leader has gained a level. No crime. Population. Growing, it's growing, okay. Increases monthly population growth by... Okay, that's migration, yeah. Growth progress, plus three per month. And we need to get a hundred for the next population, I guess. Okay, so that's uh, 20 months, more or less. Takes a while. Okay. Construction ship uh, building the base, good. Uh, the SOS on Tarakis has successfully restored power to the automated shipyard over Rixim 5. The facility immediately resumed its interrupted construction order using what materials it had on hand to build three advanced raiders of an unknown design. Unfortunately, the ancient facility broke down completely afterwards and has been deemed beyond repair. We have sent crews to new ships and commissioned them into our fleet. Well, I guess it's excellent. Obviously, we could have done with a more permanent facility, but... Okay, um, go ahead and build... Oh, we can't build mining station. Um, build another star base then. There's a habitable world there too. This is this is an important area. This is where we have a border. But these guys are friendly, more or less. So hopefully, there's not going to be too much strife. Can't go there because of the hostile thing. That's 775 power. Observatory. Special. I guess we have to build that. So we need a construction ship for that too. So we've got Hazra. Let's build another star base down here. Well, it's not alarming, but it's worrisome. Anyway, uh, population growth speed is nice. Tile blockers. Anyway, population growth speed is good. Okay, yes, credits. Well, we're uh, building a mining station here to get more credits, so... Or I thought we were. Oh, I, we were building the shipyard, uh, not the shipyard, the station first. Uh, what can only be described as a dimensional portal has been discovered. All sorts of dangerous things. Uh, in a remote location on uh, Dorelian Prime, weather prediction algorithms notice a strange air current, which was eventually determined to be caused by the sli slight leakage of atmosphere into the portal. The rate of loss is far too small for it to make any difference to life on Dorelian Prime, but the very existence of this portal raises some disturbing questions, such as, where does it lead to? And could something come through the portal from the other side? Yes, yes, very disturbing questions. New special project. Okay, we have enough to adopt a new tradition. Uh, new colonies start with one additional population, sounds pretty good. The star base influence cost would be next up. What's this next? Population growth speed. Yeah. Let's proceed to multiply like rabbits. Yes. I thought there was something... Um, observatory. Yeah, there's the observatory project there. Okay, who's complete? Okay. Construction complete. I would like you to... Okay, we don't have enough to build that. Yet, so while we're waiting for the ability to build that, why don't you build another research station there? 
Okay, other construction ship. You're up there. And you can build a research station too. We are balanced on credits temporarily. Can we uh, send a research... Uh, survey that system, please? And what about our other science ships? They really should not be just sitting around. They all need to be going over here, I think. The Casaranis is our, like, uh, our original and very important ship, our vanguard. Okay, Corvette hull points. Corvette build speed and build cost. The, all of these are really important. I... Let's make them stronger. Construction complete. Leader has gained a level. Okay. Okay, uh, go ahead and build a mining station while you're there. I want research stations. Oh, uh, you know what? Just go to Dorelian and build a research station there first. Don't want to have the constructor cross the whole place. Well, it's a big map. I have to keep that in mind. It looks like we're doing very well, but there's a lot of room. I remember when I played the Kerbal playthrough in Stellaris a long, long time ago. We, we managed to be a very large civilization without any uh, without starting anything, you know, starting picking any fights or anything. And then everything collapsed, so... Gotta worry. Kaz Station, indeed. Okay, we've got a colony ship here. I've been wanting to colonize one of these. Let's see. Tropical world is our kind of world. There's a continental world there and a tundra world. That's 80%. So... I want to colonize that planet. Drayden Prime. Yeah, sure. Okay, leader has gained a level. Still want to do that observatory, but we need to... We have enough influence now. So if this one is all done with other stuff, go ahead and... Oh, we can't... Oh, we, ha uh, we haven't fully surveyed that. Uh-oh. I did not expect that. Where... Oh. Um, okay. This one is en route, I think. Survey that system. Colonization in progress. Excellent. Only colonization was this simple in Kerbal Space Program. <laughs> no, that wouldn't be any fun. Okay, we need way more energy credits, so obviously colonizing that system would be good. We need to uh, get a constructor over here to build um, a mine. So, construction ship Lothranda. Lothan yeah, Lothandra, yeah. Build mining station there. And construction ship up there. We have enough to... Anomaly. Whoop, anomaly. A large amount of ship debris can be found in orbit around this moon, possibly the remnants of some kind of massive fleet action. Research. Okay, um... We can build a starbase there, but maybe we should build it on our frontier instead. Um... This is unsurveyed, but once it's surveyed, we could that, that would block people from coming up this way. So I'm just gonna send it down there right now to get it ready. Uh, through hard work and experience, co co coordinator Nog has developed new skills. Always good to hear. Physics 
energy credits from technicians. Um, sure, we seem to need energy credits, so let's just proceed with that. Okay, anomaly found in Hithram. Okay, we yeah we're working on that already. And leader is getting to level. Systems have been surveyed. Good, good. And technology, population growth speed. Let's pick a new research. And gene clinics or off-world trading company. Gene clinics. Construction complete. Our new building. Not upkeep. I don't have energy credits to throw around at things. Um, produces two trade value for each trade hub. Well, I mean, I don't know the value of trade, but these this this trade value thing yet. But I suspect they'll be helpful in diplomacy. So yeah, let's focus on that. There is clear evidence that a massive space battle took place in close orbit of Hithram 1A at some point in the last 5,000 years. The surface on one side of the moon is pockmarked with craters from stray weapon blasts and scans from the SOS Dar Tolvonis has picked up several hulks on the ground. Though these wrecked ships are all in very poor condition, the fact that anything remains at all after the damage uh, they have, uh, they must have sustained, is a testament to their advanced design. Science officer Reti, daughter of Jerk, Jerk, uh, is uh, preparing an expedition to sift through these derelict hulls for any valuable technologies. Okay. Where is that constructor ship? Okay, it's still on its way to Hicks. Well, good thing we uh, set it on its way sooner rather than later. You, could you build the research stations there? Okay, we can adopt a new tradition. Population growth speed. Uh, I think, like I said, breeding like rabbits. Sure. So, that science ship right there is not doing anything. Survey this system. Science ship here is not doing anything. That is looks like a key system. Look, it's like at the... There's three different branches like this. Okay, so we've got that observatory thing to take care of, and this Mount Graveyard expedition. Okay, at this point I'm gonna send it over here and build a star base. Or, uh, wait, 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 hold, oh, uh, hold, hold, um... Oh, okay, well, these guys want to talk. Kazams! How delightful! Or oh, Kazams! We hadn't expected to encounter you for a few centuries yet. How did you know? Anyway, uh, personally, I thought you would wipe yourselves out long before leaving your gravity well, but I'm glad to be proven wrong. Okay, I speak on behalf of the Kazamia people, or our, uh, our standard thing is our citizens greet you in peace. It's like live long and prosper or something. Um, I should have clicked on that. What is this? Oh, it's Delta Squad again. I want to go to this special project, but I can't just click on special project. So, where are the special projects hiding? Indian map, diplomatic. I need to know. Where are you, special projects? Um, situation log, maybe? Um, Oh, we would have to to probe this dimensional portal. Okay, pause, please. Um, we would have to devote science to it. Finishes in 24 months. Could be worth it. There's the graveyard. We have to...
I guess we need to send a scientist to that graveyard expedition. Okay, investigate. Okay, let's investigate these. Del That's the special project. Okay. Well, let's work through these. We detected ion trails. Okay, track on map. Okay, so we need scientists. I thought we would need something else, but okay. So, can we do this? Research projects and system. Uh, you can go over here. Research projects and system. And suddenly it seems like a good idea to send... Up oh, shift. That's the way I want to go. To Hixum. I mean, the Delta squad, maybe not. Uh, how about one to each? One to Julau and one to... Hixum. Uh, I mean, neither is going to be good enough to defeat these uh, Delta aliens. Unknown, fully crewed science ship to explore a system like that. Yeah, obviously. Okay, unpause. But to be sure, I want to claim Hixum before the Delta bunch get through. But uh, this is a friendly empire. Oh no, there's a fallen empire. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. I thought uh, we communicate with them, right? Oh. Hmm. They're a friendly fallen empire? I guess. Okay, um, how... Okay, Dreaden Prime is building up. We've got three population here now. Uh, that's not enough to unlock a new building slot yet. Hmm? What's that? Low colony automation stockpile. Okay, forget automation manual then. It's probably not going to be able to be self-sufficient or anything. Okay, what's that? Where's that construction ship? Okay. Oh, that's the gateway. Hmm, okay. Uh, yeah, I wanted to claim... Oh, there's one right there already. Build Starbase. Wow, that, that's expensive, that Starbase. We needed a lot of influence for that one. That's probably because of the proximity of this. So we'll have to wait until we claim that one. Let's just have this one focus on getting more um, science. But we don't have a whole lot of places to do that. How much would it take to claim Thurin Malba? We need more still. Yeah, that was expensive, Hixum. Hey, the science ships are busy, and that's very important. Uh, special project complete. Oh, special project complete. The team under science officer Reti, daughter of Jerk, has finished their expedition on Hithram 1A and returned to the SOS Dar Talvanis. Sadly, the wrecked starships on the surface were too badly damaged to recover any useful technologies. These vessels were clearly advanced, however and we could gain valuable engineering insights if we analyzed the way they were designed. We should consider the construction of a permanent science outpost in orbit. Okay, well, um, once we... Well, let's... Yeah, once we have enough influence to build a station there, we can do that. Guess we can't really... Let's investigate here. Research projects and system. Just waiting on influence, really. Okay, here can we uh, build mining stations quickly? We really need the energy credits. We would also like to have it in Wuei. Special project complete. 
Okay, the archaeological dig on way 1A has uncovered a small mural in one of the observatory's dust-covered small chambers. It seems to depict several different constellations, possibly as they would appear if, vi if viewed from the Voltam homeworld. Our astronomers have not been able to identify the individual stars. Uh, minor artifacts found, plus one Voltam artifact artifacts recovered. We gain some physics research. Good. Well, okay. Uh, uh, time has proceeded faster than I thought it had. Uh, I just started this episode, but now we're, it looks like we're 45 minutes in. So I'm going to pause it right there. And we will. And just a reminder I am in Iron Man mode. There's no saving and loading, which for now has not been a tricky thing, but I expect eventually it's going to get a whole lot dicier. But anyway. Uh, for this episode, I'll say thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.